undoing it and setting it up like I would for a normal Sunday morning or music set that you would do. Um, so there's two little clasps on the side and then there's one clasp right there. Kind of hard to do this with one hand. So that kind of opens the lid part. So then I open it up and this whole thing unhinges actually. And I kind of just slowly set that backstage. And then I've got my keyboard in here. This is my laptop stand. So I put that in right here and I have two bolts that I screw in right there and then right there. Um, and then well, before I do that, I'll show you these two things. So this opens up, sorry, my videography isn't the best. And I just keep, that's my nano control. That's just cords that I use and that's my obviously sustain pedal. And the, those things are the, um, the wooden, oh, my mind's going blank, but basically the stands. And I'll show you how they work. Um, they're Velcroed in, as you can see right there and right there. I haven't used this in a while, so it's kind of a mess in there. But they're Velcroed in. I normally take all of that stuff out and basically, um, that little thing screws in the bottom of, of these things. And, um, just like so, it just screws into there. Um, and then that becomes your stand. Um, and these actually work pretty well. It's a little bit wobbly. And actually, if I have access to a keyboard stand, I normally just set it on top and don't even bring these things out because it's a little bit more sturdy, but these things are really nice. If you don't have a keyboard stand and you just want like a one-stop setup. Also, um, I promise I would show you guys some imperfections. So <laughs> it doesn't look that bad actually in real life because the keyboard is sitting there. But you can just see me to just see some stuff that's just something I can get away right now um just want to make sure that you guys know what you're buying this so this has enough room this laptop stand has enough room for a 15 inch I had a 15 inch 2015 MacBook Pro so pretty big one and then it has enough room for the nano control to set right here um and then normally I put my scarlet right here Normally, I put my Scarlet in this setup, actually. Um, depends on what case you're using for this Scarlet. But put my Scarlet right here, and then like a USB hub right here. And then actually, one thing that I forgot to show you guys. Um, in here, there is a hole. And that's where cords, that's where I run that. Actually, so I run the cords through there and then down into there. Um, you can do it however you want, but that's where my sustain pedal goes. That's where those cords go. Um, yeah, that's it.